Number 5. Chip Chan Chip Chan is the name given to a mysterious Korean woman whose life has been broadcasted on the internet for years now. She was first discovered on 4chan in an unsecured webcam thread, where, due to the lack of movement, she was initially presumed dead. However, it turned out that she was only sleeping at the time. Chip Chan had made claims that in 1999, a police officer, who she refers to as P, implanted a Vera chip in her ankle, which means that he now has access and control over her and can now even make her sleep on command. She has created many cryptic signs over the years for viewers of the stream to see, which have now been hard to translate due to the video quality. However, some viewers have warned not to be fooled. One post from an unknown source, presumably the culprit, claims, I can't be stopped. Apparently, the stalker used this skill up until about 2006, and now Chan claims that she sleeps up to 20 hours every day. She also claims that she doesn't know what happens while she sleeps, and that she's always been afraid of sleeping. And while Chan claims that the Vera chip in her ankle has stopped her from leaving her home, she has been seen leaving her apartment on occasion wearing a disguise. She's also been seen by viewers sleeping in very strange positions for up to 20 hours per day, sometimes even in a filing cabinet. There are many theories surrounding Chip Chan, but the most widely accepted is that she's mentally ill. However, a list of questions remain, such as, who exactly is she? Who set up the camera in her apartment? And for what reason? Number 4. The Mystery Email One night in November of 2011, Tim Hart said that he received an email from his best friend, Jack Freeze, which read, Did you hear me? I'm at your house. Clean your effing attic. The subject heading read, I'm watching. Tim Hart explained that once he saw the email, he turned ghost white. The reason being, well, Jack Freeze had died five months earlier after suffering from an abnormal heart rhythm. Tim claimed in an interview with the BBC that the last time he had saw his best friend of 17 years, that the pair were in his attic, where Jack had made fun of the mess and the dust in it. He said that it was only the two of them in there when Jack had mentioned that he should clean the attic. Jack's cousin, Jimmy McGraw, also received an email in November which read, Hey Jim, how are you doing? I knew you were gonna break your ankle, tried to warn ya. Gotta be careful, Jack Freeze. A week prior, Jimmy had broken his ankle on his way to work. Jack's friends and family say that no one knew his password or had access to his email account. They also said that they don't believe his account was hacked. Tim said that he replied back to the email, but he hasn't received a response. The source of the emails remain a mystery. Number 3. Parker Wright A YouTube channel created by a man named Parker Wright posted a mysterious video with a creepy mask titled 11BX 1371. He also posted photos of the mask on Facebook. He also posted a second video titled 11B 3 1369 containing an eerie audio track throughout and we see the same character walking through what appears to be another abandoned building. The video features many more hidden messages, ranging from Morse code and sign language to a voice hidden in the audio, as well as even more images. The video also features a mysterious, unidentified woman. Parker posted coordinates to his Facebook page, which led a number of people to find USB sticks, which were hidden in different locations in and around Poland containing the second video he uploaded. In an interview, where his face was blurred and his voice was disguised, Parker claimed that both of the videos were simply artistic and nothing more. However, many people don't buy that excuse due to the sheer amount of hidden ciphers and code in both videos, and because of the disturbing nature of some of the images that were found, the almost threat-like statements that he made, as well as the cryptic riddles he had tweeted. In March 2016, Parker announced on Twitter that his new website was up and running which most likely contains even more hidden images, and may even be the place where he'll upload his next video. So, are these videos part of a project, or are they something more? What do you think? Number 2. 973 EHT NAMUH 973 Since first being discovered, the mysterious 973 EHT NAMUH 973.com has baffled most people that have visited the site. 973, which starts off with a wall of text containing the words AMAZING, followed by abracadabra a number of times, soon appears to show the mental ramblings of an insane person. 
However, the more you read the contents of the site, the more there seems to be a method to the madness. The layout of the website is very simple, with just text and a black background. However, it is full of verses from the Bible and many other religious and spiritual writings, and includes grids of numbers which implies some sort of meaning. The site contains numerology throughout, with the predominant number being 9 for some reason. There is also a mirrored theme, which is evident in the site's name, which spells out the human in reverse. There are many surreal paintings between the writings, which only adds to the creepiness. The strange and cryptic site has sparked much discussion on the internet, but nobody appears to truly know what the site's purpose is, and for what reason it was created. Theories ranging from the occult to insanity have been put forward. A British artist named David Dennison has been revealed to be the creator and owner of the site. However, the true meaning behind it still remains a mystery. Number 1. Cicada 3301 Cicada 3301 has been described as the most elaborate and mysterious puzzle of the internet age. The unknown group, known only as Cicada 3301, first appeared in January 2012, after this image was posted on 4chan, which read, Hello, we are looking for highly intelligent individuals. To find them, we have devised a test. There is a message hidden in this image. Find it, and it will lead you on a road to finding us. We look forward to meeting the few that will make it all the way through. Good luck, 3301. As you'd expect, the internet went crazy and began frantically searching for the supposed hidden message in the image. After opening the image in a text editor program, a code was revealed that led to a second image. Many participants of the puzzle claim that after decoding the second image using steganography software, that they were led to this cryptic Reddit forum, which included many more clues such as symbols, coded messages, strange images, and even revealed a US phone number. Once the number was called, an automated message was heard which included yet again another clue. From there, participants of the online puzzle were led to a website which showed a list of geographic coordinates below a picture of a cicada. The coordinates were all in different locations from around the world including Poland, France, the USA, and Australia. In each location, posters were discovered attached to streetlights which included a picture of a cicada and a QR code. Once the QR codes were scanned, this led to yet even more clues. Shortly after the posters were found, Cicada uploaded a final image on Reddit, which read, We have now found the individuals we sought. Thus, our month-long journey ends. For now. Thank you for your dedication and effort. If you are unable to complete the test or did not receive an email, do not despair. There will be more opportunities like this one. After the final image was posted, Cicada went quiet until the next year when a new image was posted to 4chan and the puzzle began again. Nobody knows who's behind Cicada 3301 and what happened to the people that made it all the way through. Some people believe the puzzle was set up as a recruitment tool by the NSA, CIA, or MI6 who are looking for the world's best code breakers. Others believe Cicada to be a secret society, cult, hacking group, or just simply an alternate reality game. However, no one knows for sure. In January 2016, Cicada posted a new image to Twitter, and the mysterious online puzzle started all over again. Thanks so much for watching, and if you enjoyed the video, please let me know by clicking the like button, share, and write a comment. And don't forget to subscribe so that you can check out my next video.